What's going on everybody? Welcome to day 10 vegetarian challenge. It's a little later in the day. It's probably like four o'clock. We slept late and then we edited the vlog when we got up. So we've had a late start today, but we got some sort of a date situation going on. We're gonna go to a Japanese grill, get some vegetarian sushi and some veggie plate stuff. Then Diamond vs Superman, gonna be a real chill day. Probably a shorter vlog. Hope you enjoy. So you guys are probably wondering, Chase, you're going to the movies. Do you eat buttery, nasty popcorn at the movies? I'm just kidding, it's not nasty, it's delicious. But, no is your answer. We sneak it. This, this, my friends, Boom Chicka Pop. Totally natural, relatively healthy popcorn. We're gonna put it in another purse, I'm gonna take it in, I'm gonna eat the shit out of it. I'll probably eat the whole fucking bag. Cause that's my life and I do what I want. My main goal at the movies tonight, so when I go to the movies typically, I love doing popcorn and I love doing soda because that's just, that's my one time where I'm like, I'm gonna eat the shit out of some popcorn, blah, blah, blah. Really like doing that, but I can substitute the popcorn. This is gonna sound horrible. I've never gone to the movies and not drink soda. Tonight is the first night I'm gonna get water at the movies. Gotta be honest, I'm a little worried about it. We'll see how it goes. I gotta be strong, make healthy choices because I'm tired of being a fat kid. Chase is resourceful. We are at a Japanese restaurant getting dinner for day night. Just a regular ginger salad. Okay, so what did you get? Um, sweet potato roll, cucumber roll, asparagus roll, avocado roll, all vegetable. Nice, and here is just grilled veggies and fried rice. And no meat in the fried rice too. Right. So, Yay. killing the veggie Japanese style. So now we are headed to the movies. We just finished dinner at um, a little Japanese place and eating vegetarian was pretty easy. One thing that I do know is that we are going, Chase and I are both going to have to focus on figuring out what works better for our bodies as far as like the macros go so like protein and carbs and fat um, because we've never really been vegetarian for this like long of a time we are used to relying on meat for protein and that's pretty much how it's been our entire lives so now that we don't have that it's it's kind of weird trying to figure out where protein we can get protein besides protein shakes, which we are going to start doing more of um, until we learn more. So we've been talking a lot of crap lately on like fast food for doing vegetarianism stuff and I'm pretty sure that was one of the first times we had gone into like a sit down restaurant and tried to do the vegetarian thing. I don't know how many restaurants are typically like that, but as far as like a Japanese restaurant, and our waiter was really good, and when he noticed that we were ordering all the vegetarian stuff, he started asking us questions like about dietary stuff like that. So good job, waiter dude. But a sit down restaurant wasn't as bad as these fast food places that we've been complaining about recently here on the vlog. But I was really happy with how easy that was. There was a couple things we had to take off of the normal stuff that we get, but it was really good. And I don't feel like super uh, like weighed down right now, but We're I feel tired. like I ate a good, good amount, huh? Or tired or anything. Yeah, I don't feel tired or anything like that. So I was really, I really like the feeling of being able to go out, eat, have a good time, not worry about like, well, how many calories am I gonna take in? We just ate what we wanted to eat. You know, it included rice and stuff like that. And I don't feel real sluggish right now, so that's... And again, it was pretty cool that we didn't, like we couldn't even eat all of our food. But yeah, like we, we didn't even finish all, like it was a giant plate of vegetables, but I, I ate till I could not eat any more vegetables and I'm still like, okay, cool, yeah, awesome. So, really cool. Alrighty, can you guys see the popcorn in the background? We're at the movies, we're gonna go see Batman vs Superman, should be, I don't, I guess I don't need these anymore. We're gonna go see Batman vs Superman, we're gonna sneak the popcorn in, but we are gonna buy water, cause otherwise I would feel bad. And it should be a fun time, we'll let you guys know how it is when we get back and cut to that right now. We just left uh, the Superman Batman movie, however, whatever the movie's called. Um, my, my quick review of the movie was it started off really slow, and it ended pretty good and I cannot wait for whatever next movie comes out that involves Wonder Woman because I 
feel like they were vague with her on purpose, so I look forward to seeing what they're gonna come out with uh, with her. What's your review of the movie? I thought it was solidly okay. Wasn't a bad movie, it did start out slow. It ended all right. Um, I, like I told you in the theater, I think that movie was legitimately just created so that DC could have their Justice League line of movies. And I wish that was a little less apparent, but I'm not really upset about it because, you know, comic book movies, pretty cool. Yeah, that was pretty much it. I was telling Heather before we turned the camera on, no longer gonna go see movies on a Sunday because with us both working our own schedules, we don't have to. So many children in that movie. And I feel like I would have liked the movie more if I could have like just zoned out and like watched the movie. But hearing kids yell and scream an entire movie totally ruins like that, like zone out, enjoy your movie thing. So it would be very nice if parents that had kids that they couldn't control in the movie just like politely left so that the entire theater of that movie doesn't get ruined. So that was unfortunate. But I think I would have liked the movie more if that situation wouldn't have gone down. We're headed home and we will see you tomorrow and I'm gonna hand you over to Chase who... Was that? That was weird as hell, right? It sounded like something fell like, oh, okay. <laughs> anyways, I'm gonna turn the camera over to Chase and let him do his little goodbye thing. Oh, so the tables have turned. Now you're the one being the do your bye thing. Yeah. Alright guys, well, it is the end of the weekend. Tomorrow starts a brand new week. We're very excited for next week because we're going to try really hard to get back on the schedule. We'll talk about all the food eating differences we're going to do next week, tomorrow, in tomorrow's vlog. So hopefully you guys enjoyed our first, our first like technically official week, like full week of vegetarian stuff. If you guys like the video, make sure to give us a virtual hug by hitting the like button. And uh, work hard, be possible. We'll see y'all in tomorrow's vlog. Please don't get killed in traffic.